Hey guys, welcome to the channel. As you can see tonight, we are in super high mode with the camera. And why is that, you ask? Well, basically, because of this. Bam! This is the Hot Toys, the Falcon and the Winter Soldier, Winter Soldier figure. Yeah, so my daughter pre-ordered this um, car a long, long time ago. She did the thing where you pay so much a month, and then when you've paid it off, you're supposed to get it. But I think she waited like an extra year on top of that to get it. But it's here now, so let's have a look, see if the £250 she paid for this is worth it. A huge box with the face of Sebastian Stan. Marvel Studios, the Falcon and the Winter Soldier, which in my personal opinion was rubbish. I know they had to do like many, many reshoots, didn't they? Oh, ha, ha. Official Hot Toys. And the side. Basically the same sort of thing. And the bottom. And darker version of the other side. And the back. Hot Toys presents television masterpiece series The Falcon and the Winter Soldier. The Winter Soldier. TMS 0319 scale collectible figure. Warning, choking hazard, small parts, not for children under three years old. Adult collectible, not at all. Recommended for ages 15 and up. Alright, yeah, so this is basically the long version of that there. Many different languages. That one, recycling, that one. Hot Toys, produced by Hot Toys. That's the address if you still haven't received yours yet. Uh, contact them on Facebook. Alright, official retail store, Rebel Base in Hong Kong. Official retail store. Another one, so there's two. Oh, there we go. 2022 Hot Toys Limited. The Hot Toys Secret Base, Toy Hunter, Rebel Base, and Echo Base are trademarks and copyrights of Hot Toys Limited, all rights reserved. Marvel. And the barcode for you, barcode battlers. Please keep this packaging for future reference made in China. Right, are we ready? What does £250 buy you? This has already been opened by the way. Just to check it. F, the top ever comes up. And super reflectiveness because of the light switch. Will be sorted soon because obviously we'll be taking him out of the box. But yeah, so it goes like his, yeah, there's me, his face protector. Uh, you really can't see anything because of the reflection. And the back, kind of looks like a really expensive shoe box. Yes, let's not beat about the question, get him out. Alright. So, I do believe I have to be careful because I think my daughter would cry if this broke. And uh, I mean, it even came in as like the proper official shipping box. Well, I can't remember where she pre ordered it from, but I know she was just annoyed when it just kept being so late. Alright. Please read instruction sheet first and follow all construction details. Yeah, the reflections ain't making any good, are they? And there is the instruction sheet. So the tape to the bottom. And yeah, nothing to the back. Right. So top comes off. Instruction sheet comes off. Bits go all over the place. But there he is. So let's just take him out, shall we? There we go. So there is Sebastian Stan, the Winter Soldier for us all to see. Which, let's be honest, he should be Captain America, not not the Falcon. It does state in instructions not to take his coat off. I mean, when we got this, this arm it wouldn't bend. My daughter was super paranoid about moving it, so I basically eased it in. And uh, yeah, so he's got like boot parts that are that just protector parts and not part of boots, but. Detailing is phenomenal. That's £250 it should be. I mean they all move like so. And uh, yeah, all the way around. Obviously you can't do that much with this one because of the jacket. Because it's definitely all in one piece how they got it on there. That actually looks like a real zip. Yeah, I'm not going to play with that. Definitely not going to play with that. But yeah, he does look awesome. Let's have a look what he comes with. So... This is the little instruction booklet. Let's open this up. 
or try and open it up, it doesn't try and seal itself. Alright, just basically explaining how much of it moves. Oh look, <laughs> how to use the machine guns. That is pretty awesome. And the wrist. I just got a pointy knife. And yeah, ready for war. Right, so that bit that kind of protects him. And we got well, the bit at the back that they put in that is not like sweets, which you don't really want to eat. So there is the stand. Sebastian stand. Sorry, the soldier. Right, and we have, as we've fallen out, the part of the stand here. This hmm, uh, goes on here. You always have to put these in at an angle, like so, and then push with all your might. And in the bottom part that's fallen out already, we have the knife. Oh my god, that is awesome detail. Amazing, amazing detail. Right to one side, we have the machine gun magazine clip. So let's pop the machine gun out and have a look at that. So, that is freaking awesome. It's got quite a bit moving on it. We'll have a look at that in a second. Really cool target. Right, so. Mm, don't want to, right, so that pulls out basically. And then this part here comes down. And obviously separates. Right, and we did see a part. Oh, oh, there we go. That lifts up. That's pretty cool. So this obviously helps with the targeting with them parts there. And then, so, what is that, what is this, oh, like the whole thing moves that, but yeah, so that, that's going to be like the reload, just, <laughs> that was my elbow, um, as I wasn't paying, oh right, so I see when that's done, you can twist it, I like so, so it can fit on the shoulder properly, uh, a detail, and it's actually got a bullet, which is really cool. Right, now I know it's supposed to go in there. Do we just push it in? No. <laughs> mm, let's uh, consult the instructions again. Aha, right. So, we look at this part here, and this part apparently, oh yes it does, it flips up. And then we pop the magazine. The bullet facing that way. To there, oh, that is cool. Um, yeah, that goes up, that twists around. So that is awesome. That's amazing. Let's have a look at the other bits we get. I thought we got an ultimate head, but we don't. So there is. What looks like. Oh, there, there's the little stubs. We can change the hand. So he has different hands. Obviously, if he wants to hold the gun in that hand. This is the uh, vibranium hand. Um, punchy punch, punchy punch, a knife hand, gun hand, and free hand. All right, so let's pop that out of the way, and I, I assume it just goes. Hmm. I say, does that slide up? Let's have a look, skis. Oh. It does, right, I'm with you. So you kind of like put him on there, and he gets hands down there. Um, did we see anywhere for this knife to go? Ooh, right. So, oh, right, so you get him flat and you angle it down to that. Mm, checking to see if the knife actually went anywhere. No, it just basically says don't cut yourself with it. And uh, the machine gun. Obviously, I haven't put his right hand on for this. But yeah, that goes. <laughs> Come on, just just hold it, just for this, just for this shot. There we go. And then we put that there. And uh, 
Yeah. So I'm going to bring the camera out and uh, down a little bit just so we can see it. And there is the knife. I mean, it's, he is huge. He is massive. But there you go. That is the Hot Toys 1 to 6 scale, the Falcon and the Winter Soldier. He should have been Captain America.